better. That's a chunky EMP. Fires right around the corner. That's Edison taken out. The symbol is down, though, and it might give them a bit of damage mitigation, but not enough. Samara and Massa to keep them alive. Still, Iris moved off the map, actually, by the boosters of Hanbin. Still a potentially winnable fight here for the Atlanta Reign. Three players on the deck, they might be able to fight this out with only Sparkle's damage that's just been shredding them as time goes on. You've got to back off from this, but they are just playing oh. so aggressive. Oh. What is that? It's all supposed to be mortality build. The stick is good. Look at the damage. Yeah, well, on the Jonathan Piggy, Juvie taking a lot of damage again. They have a nano boost. Fielder is going to pop the nano boost before Crypto even has a chance because Sparkle is up here getting a 3k. Making sure that Jangu is out of this fight. They do have the nano boost from Crimzo and Juvi, but the Dallas Fuel are now letting it loose. Now the nano boost too, and the grabs to follow up. Fearless is right there trying to punch their way in. Sparkle gets that pull to pick onto Juvi again. This is like the third pull to pick of the map that Juvi unfortunately falls victim to. Look at this payload right now. John, it's right there, and there's nobody from the Outlaws to stop them. The Dallas Fuel, they win the Texas Showdown again. Sparkle trying to claw things back later in the fight and back. The Justice committed, but the fuel stay alive. What a ridiculous fight. Right now, the triple cut from Doha, but again, unable to do anything. He couldn't even build up the South Destruct. A nice grab, though. What a turnaround. Happen, catching the players unaware. Slip down, catching on the Gaga. This is already in the blink of an eye, turned away of the Dallas Fuel. Up to try and assist the rest of his team. But the card is almost at the finish line of checkpoint B. Jumping straight in the synchronization there as Lee just lays down the post bomb. It's not even necessary. Still, the kills just going through regardless. And look at that tracking just locking onto the heads. Beautiful work. Still, the Dallas Fuel not willing to get this one up. Sparkle! What? Okay, why not? The EMP comes through into the post bomb. That's a little two beast. He's just doing so much. For them. It's gonna be an air matrix though that comes down from Fielder. You deal off quick. I have a fielder playing those headshots through the M.A. Took Pelican trying to get there with those eyes and slap. Yeah, this will this will be Dallas Fuel taking this first point. Two takes, two counting. Barrage, and beautiful. It is raining. <laughs> Rockets. Walking, trying to get those micro rockets on target for Jexa, but he's in Valkyrie. There's not much that can be done, and Fearless gets to have a pretty gainful primal raid. Some damage on the mech here, and it's a little bit hard to heal Hawk for where he was. Somehow Spock was able to get three kills in that. I don't think that was part of the plan for Atlanta. Yes, Hawk is going to get a, a mech back, so not a mech back in this fight until we get played. Uh -huh. Oh, you're going to lose Gaga for it. It's a sleep actually hit on the lead there. Lap them on the offense, spawn camp them on the defense. It's unreal that these six players could be put in this position by anyone, let alone the Hunters. Here's a Graviton Surge, and they are starting to start on them a little bit. Matt, I'm going to be honest, Lego is down! Oh, nothing could be more Chengdu than what we just saw. Mind boggling. It's got to put pressure on the opponents, though, because the what is happening. It's all or nothing, man. No other way about it. Fearless is able to capitalize on a monk that has his shield stripped from him. Light Young is not going to escape either, so nice setup there for Doha. Dallas trying to stabilize.